And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for sticking around. Once again, we find ourselves in the pro side, which is a bathhouseless bathhouse lake side. Uh, again, I'm joined by. Sorry, I completely zoned out. I was really thinking about that delicious ice cream I just finished. Oh, <laughs> absolutely incredible. Such caramel. But anyway, I am joined by two wonderful people once again. We've got Agro beside us. Hello. And we have X Time. Yow. Oh, he did it again. That's it. End the stream. It's over. We're going. Uh, it doesn't get much better than that. I think even your ice cream pales in comparison to, uh, really to the Yow. My, my, ice, my ice cream is melted in my hands just for if, how, uh, how, how amazing that was. Oh. X Time, if, if Yow was a flavor of ice cream, what would it taste like? <laughs> Uh, probably uh, pineapple and habanero with a little bit of lemongrass and ginger. Ooh. That's the leading candidate Ooh, right now. That's exotic. Oh, wow. uh, either that or just peppermint, because peppermint can't be a good bit of peppermint. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's actually, in season right now. I've actually got a tub of peppermint ready to eat. Ooh. I'm not what a peppermint ice cream. Does it taste like toothpaste, dude? No, it's what? really good. No. I made a uh, cinnamon ice cream uh, with my mm. family for Thanksgiving. It was really good. Yeah, well, that thing's delicious. Yeah, I think next time though, it needs like uh, red hots, like little like cinnamon candies, hard candies in it. I think mm. we should change the team names to ice cream flavors. To be honest with you, um, that's all right. That's all right. Oh, it's like the food food themed uh, uh, games, right? We tried that for the Nations Cup. We tried to talk about Jeez. a food item from each uh, nation that was playing. That was that was a lot of fun. Give me a moment. I'm um, going to find out what teams are playing this time. Yeah, we don't have any. Uh, <clears throat> we don't have CJ here, so I'm not sure if any of these players involved are chefs themselves or do some cooking videos, cooking streams. But let me just run down the rosters of the two teams that we have here, and uh, it does look like on blue will be the unnamed. Their scout is JPEG. JPEG, <clears throat> excuse me. Soldier is Taylor your TF. From last match. Pyro is TC2. Devil Man will be Scrub Lord Kyle, heavy weapons guy, played by Springy. Mr. What's His Face will be on Engineer. Medic is Alex Unknown, uh, Dude the Ninja on Sniper, and Gentu the Spy. Their team captain is their engineer, Mr. What's His Face. They will be up against the Sleep Squad with their scout, Lazy Purple, their soldier, Zulu Man. And uh, their pyro mm, Sternchich. Uh, uh, that's a tough one. Sternch. 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 Satan Rich. Satan Satan Rich. Satan there's Rich an extra one. there's an extra T in there. Anyways, demo man no, no, will a, be a heavy a, purple. Yeah, that, that, that's that's, <laughs> that's silent. Whatever, whatever. We're moving on. Silent. Uh, <laughs> heavy weapons guy will be circuit. And engineer is grandpa. Met will be played by Oast. Sniper is Ultaki. And Spy will be procked with the team le uh, led by Lazy Purple. Ah, uh, the beautiful voice there, drawing out those words. Mmm, beautiful. These are the casters you're stuck with today, folks. The only one of them's a professional. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. Enjoy. Oh, no, I wasn't talking about you. It was talking about me. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's a lie I tell myself to make myself feel better. But anyway. <laughs> Yeah, players have uh, been given the go-ahead, so this will be our second Highlander match. We'll be interested to see how these two teams approach the map. Um, should be a lot of fun. Last one was fun. Oh, yeah, definitely. Fully agree. So, um, what's your favorite, favorite ice cream flavor? Uh, Dude, the ninja <laughs> flavor. Ooh, yummy. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I see a Peter Scraps in the, the background scene. What are you doing here? Get out of here. Go. Go, scrap. Oh, it looks like we're beginning there. Is this it starting? Is this us? No, not yet, bro. But uh, should be soon, hopefully. Sorry, I started spectating someone who was coming out of spawn. It completely fooled me. I lost track of where I am. Well, charity event, and we got another couple hours uh, ahead of us afterwards because we will be doing some night comp stuff later, which uh, I'm excited to see that. We had solar oh, light in this last game, but this game will be two straight up demo men. Just sticky bombs. And it looks like we are beginning now. <laughs> <laughs> Exciting stuff. Who are we who are we voting for, guys? Who do we think? Um, you know, I like the lazy purple team, but I know that uh, JPEG's uh, a fragger, um, so really could mm. go either way here. 
Oh, I'm more uh, than familiar with JPEG. Oh, dear lord. Yeah, right now it is the uh, Demo Man. I don't know if that name is uh, proper. Um, Taylor TF also picking up um, a rocket kill on proc right now. Who's going to go down? So right now it is blue team with a little bit of lead, lead here. Just a little bit. Uh, we have uh, Mr. What's his face for blue team going into the bathhouse. Do you know learning his name? So, oh yeah, Mr. Yeah. Space. Yeah. God. <laughs> <laughs> well, it doesn't matter what his name is. He's dead now, so uh, bless. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. Oh, it looks like Red have pushed uh, the unnamed team back a little bit, but they are fighting back. Scrubber Kyle, you can play this one. Help wipe out. Catching Spy on his way back down, saving his team a little bit, but not before Springy gets backstabbed. Blue team yeah. are capping the point. <clears throat> And this is good control. I mean, right now we see, especially since both teams are on a uh, regular demo, both teams are uh, able to establish that dispenser. We have had an Uber exchange go down. Um, it's about to fade, but uh, Red Team were able to just kind of solo it a little bit more on the uh, heavy weapons guy. And uh, Satan Satan Rich uh, getting pushed off um, the uh, point. Soldier jumping across. Taylor oh, going for a market gardener. Doesn't get it, but does get a kill there. Proc's Sorry, got, yeah. the interruptions. Yeah. That was that was yeah, Prox getting in, getting the med down. I think both of these teams shown an excellent skill up to this point. Uh, both of them playing uh, very well together as teams uh, and then doing that progressive thing moving forward and then pulling back again. But it, it takes a it takes a play like Prox just showed us right there, uh, taking down the medic and just disrupting the game completely uh, to turn everything on its head. Uh, sorry, I'm laughing at a spy's name for uh, for unnamed into these nuts. <laughs> Oh, it's a shame he just got butter knife to death. Oh, it's uneventful. Yeah, blue team, uh, the unnamed, still in control of the point here with this uh, fully healed uh, heavy weapons guy pushing across. We'll get backstabbed though, your health pool doesn't matter. Now they're pushing over on top of this dispenser. Happy Purple though, a little bit overexposed. He's gonna get gunned down uh, by Taylor TF right behind him with an easy rocket. A JPEG also clearing up here. So blue team, they conceded the point. Uh, but they're feeling pretty strong. They might just push back on here. Overcharge has come out on the heavy weapons guy. But Ooh. need to find other people to use it on. And Ost uh, hasn't been able to do so. The Pyro, Satan Rich, has gone down. It does seem, though, Red's that uh, somehow... Yeah, Red was able to uh, survive there and uh, get some really good frags. Blue team does get away with Ooh, the Overcharge. Yeah. They just don't have the players with them to really make uh, full use of it at the moment. Well, there's Lazy Purple versus JPEG on the left-hand side there. He's trying to... JPEG's trying to stop him chasing down the Medic. Uh, scares him off a little bit. Oh, Blue Medic has popped on point. JPEG taken out. Circuit. Getting air blasted away though. I don't know what's going to happen here. Medic's done a runner. He's running. He's gone. JPEG's holding him off. Come on, JPEG. He takes out Pyro as well. And Blue seems to push forward a little bit. Laser Purple going down to Springy's minigun. Blue team are starting to cap here. Yeah, I really didn't think uh, Blue Team were going to do anything with that Uber at all. They, they blew it. They blew it in a very effectual place. They, they were right on top of the red team. Uh, just want to shout out quickly to Taylor TF for doing the amazing air shot of the, of the, uh, of the oh. entire match. Oh, uh, beautiful what? play there. Uh, but yeah, I mean, they, they, they seem to pop in exactly the right place, but then were pushed back by the pyro. So the, 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 the Uber they had was apparently wasted, but uh, they still were able to, to get the point over for themselves. And yeah. it is their clock that is ticking down right now. Yeah, they managed to claw it back from that one. They, it was a bit botched. They managed to get one kill with it and then get separated with the air blast, but they pulled that one back. However, Red does seem to be pushing back here. And the extension left get wiped out by Taylor TF. Taylor trying to get some little sneaky shots through the little gap between the obelisk and the back panel. Yeah, I'm not entirely certain that all of that was uh, was deliberate. There was uh, Zulu Man doing a incredible job. Oh, yeah, sorry, struck. it was Zulu Man doing but, that, but, not well, Taylor. Well, Zulu Man managed to sort of uh, bump him between the locations there, and I don't think uh, the, the movement was entirely under uh, Taylor's uh, Taylor's own command. Oh, sorry, so, I beg your pardon. I meant Zulu oh, Man shot between those points. Pro Prox with another uh, massive backstab combo, getting the medic and the demo man there. Ooh, this might uh, really help swing the uh, round towards red team as Ost with 75% here um, should be able to get the charge as long as he can stay away from uh, Dude and um, the Spy Gantu. JPEG has got quite a spree going, 11 frags on his scattergun right now. JPEG yeah. is a force to be reckoned with. I thought you said I played against him multiple times and I yeah. could do nothing. I'm scared of him. <laughs> <laughs> I, I refuse to play games with him. I'm too scared. Mission ends in 60 seconds. 
I've got to yeah. say, both of these teams seem to be incredibly well matched. I mean, the the, the clocks, the timers are. No, oh. neither team seems to be uh, overwhelming the other, and and like the both teams are, are building up the Uber at the same time. Although having said that, yeah, Taylor TF bombed in and uh, forced that Uber charge out. So um, right now, the blue team does have 75%, 99%. Medic is running away, oh, getting chased no. down, but Taylor TF coming in again. Get the kill on Lazy Purple. They have the Uber charge, so they could be able to get out here, but they're at a number disadvantage, and the goal of the red team here is going to be able to force this pop early. Taylor TF, though, doesn't hit the air shot there, but continuing to be a force to, reckon, to be reckoned with from this blue team. And the uh, Devil Man goes down. JPEG pushing forward here with Taylor TF. Um, they have they used the Uber oh, charge, but they lost but Taylor TF. Second a big drop there. there. Yeah, with the Derm Man and the Soldier down, that's uh, two of the major damage dealers with with really sort of make uh, use of an Uber. Okay, Blair, uh, left to the point. Oh, happy purple though. Clears a couple players Ooh. off it. Those are big frags. The blue team has captured the point back. Happy purple though, still continuing to spam stickies in. His teammates uh, just respawning, but Oast with 90% Uber charge and no medic up right now for blue team. They have to hold for 50 seconds. It's going to be a tough hold, definitely. We've got a, a dry pyro in the corner, getting one shot right there by Happy Purple. Absolutely yeah. pushing everything back. Red Team surely have got this. JPEG trying to hold them off, but he gets wiped out. It's too late. It's all over. Yeah, big stab by Proc there. Top score for his team, and also right at the end there, got a stab on the Heavy Weapons guy, mm. which, you know, that's just so much health to take off the map. Um, that, you know, when you can do that, like, that's... It's such a huge boost to your fight. There was one point where I saw again to the uh, blue team spy, the unnamed teams. Uh, was going for a backstab on the on the uh, sleep team's heavy weapons, but he just turned around at the right moment as he swung his knife, tried to run away, and then got cut off by the enemies that were pushed forward as well. And it was honestly devastating. I also just want to point out that uh, Altaki, Altaki got a headshot on someone on point there. Keeping them off it. Yeah, I've been watching Zulu Man throughout uh, this, and uh, he's definitely been doing work, hopping around that sort of uh, sandpit area and making good use of the uh, the big health uh, to to make sure that ne he's never really in a bad place. Yeah, definitely. That's what you want. Yeah, that massive health pack is uh, so strong in there, and that's why teams fight over that room. If you can have a soldier, and if he's like out death matching the other soldier. Um, it's just so huge and Taylor TF has actually been doing a lot of work on the side with the freedom that he's given on the other um, Edge of the map. Oh, oh sorry, sorry. Enough. got to address that. Oh, uh, Jenku of the nuts uh, Taking out to make apologies if I just got that name wrong, no, but no. Uh, it did seem like a pretty nutty move to me uh, And definitely a, <laughs> a, a game winning move. Maybe we'll, we'll see. We'll see uh, Yeah, I mean they got to capture the round for, uh, the, the point first, you know, they're still actually just bleeding time off their clock and um, Ost was trying to milk that uh, Uber charge for a really long time. That's part of why he was so vulnerable there. Uh, but it's also like, it doesn't matter too much because he's actually already respawned um, and has this a very slight Uber charge lead against Blue Team. Blue Team will capture the point now. It was a minute taken off it um, by our red team, the Sleep Squad. Um, Ost behind the um, Obelisk here. We'll have a spike coming in on top of him. Jumps into the swarm of players though and taken nah. down by Circuit. I was watching Gento for a little while there. That heavy was very aware of his presence. He kept turning around every time he tried to uncloak. Basically having volume in his headset. You know, like any other player would. Uh, oh, like, unlike I do. Cues. Yeah, unlike you do. Always <laughs> playing this game on mute. It's, it's, it makes it... I'm playing on hard mode. That's yeah, what I like yeah, to think. hardcore. There we go. But you're, you're just too powerful. You have to slow yourself down. I, I, I have to nerf myself somehow. Otherwise, this game wouldn't be fun for anyone else. Exactly. I entirely believe you. Into uh, millions of wooden's. Sorry, okay. uh, <coughs> uh, but I, oh. yeah, but sorry, bit of a cough there. <sighs> <laughs> but anyway, we've got some pot shots getting exchanged between demo men here. Uh, JPEG's running out, yelling for medic. Oh, Jirai got thrown on the uh, blue medic, and another fellow. Uh, this is a pretty decent attack though from the unnamed. Uh, they're able to get uh, their medic back. Get an Uber charge pop, get some frags on the Dillman and the Pyro. And uh, now they're putting damage in the circuit. They will be able to get Ooh. the kill there. Although they've lost springing to uh, the spy here. And oh, oh, but Brock gets absolutely yeah. destroyed. 
Ah! Uh, the Not unnamed too. unknown, uh, brilliant with 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 the knife attacks, uh, gets his Uber almost in fact all the way up to 100% again. Yeah, those two saws really huge there. This mini sentry is being obnoxious. They need a little bit of help taking it out. Taylor will come through with the rockets. They have this charge, and uh, it's something that they're going to want to use before they possibly drop too many he's, players yeah, here. He's walking out in the open a little bit. I'm scared he's going to get his head shot off. He's walking really in open, but he needs to heal his teammates. That is necessary, being part of a medic. Being part of a medic? I mean, I'm sure he's the whole medic. All, all of the medic. All of the, about 90%. But from maybe. the waist down. Proc did get back at one point, but Taylor wipes him out a little bit as well. Uh, anything else? Yo, these are the moments moved? when you're being a medic. You really want to be, uh, you want to be certain that there's nobody behind you, but you got to be careful of the, the sniper as well. Even yeah. when your team is surrounding you, you are the target. You're the person that everybody wants to kill. Because when you go down, uh, like the entire momentum of the team goes down, and I don't know, they think they've left it too long. They then there is a spy. Oh, he pops to save himself there. Spy, watch running straight for the med. An yeah. unnamed unknown is flashing between soldier and scout. Yeah, you gotta make things happen when you have a charge, and um, the blue team, the unnamed, that's sort of why they've been having some oh, issues. And there's the headshot I was worried yeah. about happening. Uh, Ota Kai took uh, down the med. Uh, it was kind of a, c a cunning little uh, sniper shot. That was that's sort of a ballsy shot oh, when he stood in mid. Uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm wondering whether Dude the Ninja is going to be uh, getting out some amazing uh, strats and some, some amazing kill shots soon. I'm well, hoping. I'm going to do hoping. some competitive commentating just for Ninja. Yeah, here we are. He's looking yeah. on the left of the obelisk there, getting nothing. He's moving forward. He's, he's going on to point like he needs to. There we go. He's going for it. Oh! oh, 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 oh. oh. People exploded. It's happening. And this, his power has been unleashed. He's too powerful. He won't be stopped. He's dead. Impossible. Anyway, uh, yeah. Red hold the point. Yeah. That was a really good job for the sleep squad. Um, you know, old talkie starting to turn up a bit. They were a, a little bit slower, um, just kind of on the scoreboard. You see they're kind of towards the bottom. I, I saw them getting a lot of freedom back in the ruins area. I mean, this map is uh, its played a lot in Highlander. In sixes, it was just completely thrown out because they were just like snipers too strong. You know, and a sniper is really strong on this map. Um, so and the, can't this be pro strong version, in the right hands, yeah. Yeah. Pro version also solves the uh, approaches the problems in the bathhouse. Ooh, um, but, okay. I'm know. just gonna cut you off there. JPEG was able to track where that invisible yeah. spy was hiding there, wiping him out. Oh, nice. I'm taking out Satan Rich, which we're gonna call him from now on. I'm killing, killing Happy Purple as he was flying across the screen. What? What is JPEG? He's some sort of monster. Oh, Lazy Purple's behind. Yeah, this is a lot better start for uh, the unnamed. Also, Gentoo gets the stab on the heavy ones oh. guy. That's why he's been going for this whole match. That's beautiful. I'm so proud. Oh, I'm so proud of him. Yeah, my baby boy's growing up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Taylor uh, continuing to frag pretty hard as well. Um, we'll see, like I said before, whether he'll kind of try to focus a little bit more on the sandbox area or just kind of continue to play, you know, wide on the other side of the map and bombing in. Yeah, both these mates are on pretty even oob as well. Nobody has a massive advantage. Uh, a bit of a uh, bit of Taylor team trying to get in uh, the uh, the ultimate air shot uh, of the match. I'm not sure whether he wins it, and a special prize for that uh, Prox goes in against that sniper. Ooh, Prox gets taken out, tracked by the heavy as he was trying to run away invisible there. Nicely done by him. We have Ass Smasher on his own, on point. The only demo. Oh, but he's got Lazy Purple behind him, and he goes down. And Spencer's down as well. What are Blue Team going to do? They're going to die. Nothing. They're all going <laughs> to die. Not, they're, they're dead. Yeah. Oh, God. Can we show this? It, 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 it is pretty dirty massive. right now. Uh, I mean, the unknown, the unnamed unknown is kind of out there on his oh, own yeah, right now. He wants to try and survive throughout all of this and, uh, and, and get back into a pushing position. But Blue kind of lost it. They were absolutely in control of that map, and then a few kills down, they were... They were, they were on the back foot. It crumbled faster than a cookie. Uh, in a microwave. In a micro, yeah. In a, in a cup of milk. Uh, in a cup of tea. Yeah, oh, ugh. Why would you put uh, cookies in tea? I've got the game. It is it's the that's ultimate crumbling up, machine. No! That's it's, not it's, That's going I've, back! I've By the way, there's a fight the game. But oh, yeah, yeah, no! Okay. No! Uh, no, that, that's an outrage. Yeah, we've charge from Red Team, gonna be able to use it to uh, keep the players pretty healthy on top of the point. They lose their pyro, but that's a pretty good exchange for 
um, all the other damage that they were able to get on this blue team. Kyle's trying to get out here, but he's covered in the PP. So is Taylor TF. That'll help him go down to Zulu, man. And uh, blue team very weak in this kind of back connector area. Looks like we will have a pause here. Uh, sorry. I never thought I'd ever hear X Saint C PP. Oh, yeah. <laughs> covered in the PP. Oh, God. That's so immature. I suddenly urge to think that you would make an amazing dad. Uh, I, I don't know what that <laughs> came from, but. Uh... <laughs> Make a pretty good uncle. Eh, okay. Eh, what's the difference? <laughs> I get to walk away when they piss on the floor, and it's not my problem. <laughs> Wait, <what? laughs> they piss on the floor? <laughs> you know, I mean, accidents happen with little babies, but, you know. And uh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm the uncle. If uh, mom and dad are around, that's not my problem. <laughs> oh, I am never being a parent. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, okay, we'll, we'll see about that. Never say never, my friend. Uh, well, right I'm now, saying though, right um, now. <laughs> um, we are here for our charity event, special effect, um, helping uh, gamers with uh, disabilities enjoy the fun of gaming as we do. Yeah, it's great. Like A lot of the times people think, oh, it's just games, don't worry about it. But sometimes it's games that connect you with your family, with friends, mm -hmm. stuff like that. And it is more important than you think. Uh, at the bottom left, you can see how far we are with donations. There is a link if you type exclamation mark donate. And there's info, I believe, if you type exclamation charity. Please do do those things. It's very important, not just to us, but to those less fortunate than us with disabilities. Because this company, uh, Special Effect, is there to help those people. And honestly, it's nearly Christmas. It's the time of giving. So give something that you can so that they can have something that we already have. Games. Games. Do it for the kids and do it for the games. Yeah, we, we need more gamers in the world. We're a prey. Come on. Gamers <laughs> rise. All right, as, the, as the timer goes out in the game, we don't, uh, don't forget that there is actually a, a real timer uh, that will be resuming when, when all of the players unpause. But, uh, right now, an opportunity to look at some of these beautiful cosmetics. Uh, the... Uh, the blinking owl on top of uh, Ulta Key's shoulder mm. his uh, glowing green eyes. I wonder if we should read a couple donations because we've had three since the... Uh... Yeah, we've got a little bit of time. I think we can read out some donations. Uh, if you give me a moment. I see one uh... here from uh, The Great Paul mm, uh, who yes. uh, leaves the message, uh, stay awesome. In fact, it's uh, oh, an exclamation nice. mark at the end, so it's stay awesome! Stay awesome! There's another three. Uh, two of them are guest checkouts, so I can't see the name. I had to rely on aggro for that. But there is one from Atlet Size Atlet Size Adam, uh, who has donated $2. Uh, there's no message next to it or anything. Uh, there's a guest checkout. Uh, I'm not sure who it was. They said they have lagged out of the game. And into the just giving page. I'm going to assume that that's possibly Polly Brow. That is Polly Brow right there. Oh, what a guess! I'm not sure what the newest one is, so I'll let you get that. No. Oh, wait. Hang on. I've got to do a, a, a fresh thing. Oh, yeah, I, I saw the donation notification li literally seconds as we started, and my cats are doing something. What? Uh, no, it's doing? two years from anonymous, so uh, that would. Uh, I so think it's a fully anonymous, anonymous one. None of us would have uh, got that right. Um, but Maybe that's thank name. you very much. What well, anonymous? Anonymous. I mean, if I ever had, to, if I had a child um, and my surname was Imus, um, I, I'd probably call it Anon. Come on, Anon. I know. If if like Mickey and Minnie got together, Ooh. would they call their kid Anoni? An <laughs> okay. Well, the match is back in. Oh, excuse me. Full swing. Uh, Proc just got a double backstab there, and JPEG wiping him out right outside the point. Red Team do still have control of the point. JPEG's running side to side. For my screen, he's more sliding everywhere, which is honestly terrifying. Uh, <laughs> dear God. It is the ultimate playstyle of the <laughs> resumed player. <laughs> and it's the final one. It. Why does he only have it? I'm so scared he's getting so many kills. Uh, it's a special technique he's using. Uh, it's a family technique. Oh, um, God. Oh, oh, JPEG. JPEG, JPEG and Ubered Scout is taking down a heavy. What What is wrong with this picture? Oh, God, that's terrifying. Imagine Ubered Scout sliding towards you without moving his legs. I just wiped out your whole team right next to you. 
You're the last line of the fence. He took out your family, your friends. You're the only one. And he's bearing down on you, heavy breathing, bloodshot eyes. Oh, God. <laughs> I like that's my sleep paralysis demon. But yeah, anyway, a blue team have finally captured the point back. Will they be able to hold it, however? I'm not able to see how long the sleep team has to cap because of the resuming. Yeah, I had reload scheme, pretty cool uh, command. And uh, we did just have an, an Uber stock come up for a name, so that's going to help uh, quite a bit with the uh, Uber charge there. Uh, able to, available to them in the sandbox room. Um, right now, Ost and company kind of towing, you know, just that ramp right in between ruins and the point. Stand back here. Dude has a pretty decent angle, but that um, classic is kind of hard to work with. He caught me off guard there. I was having a sip. <coughs> but, yes. <laughs> Sippy ice cream. No, no. no I, 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 got, I got a drink next to me as well. You've got to stay hydrated, everyone. I'll admit, for a moment then, I was watching Ost Smasher, thinking <laughs> that can't possibly be its real name. Um, of course it is. Right. I think uh, I think everything's been reset. I'm just an, I'm just an okay boomer at this point. Um, my oh. world has crashed down around me. Okay, boomer. Indeed. Also, I want to give a quick thank you to Simply Small Fry for the ten dollars there as well. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, unnamed has popped Uber. He and Taylor TF are trying to hold the point here by themselves. Got Demo Man on the left hand side with a medic up his ass very firmly as well. Unnamed has pulled back. Taylor has died. Lazy Purple getting launched across. Blue Team are getting pushed back. Red Team have control of the control point. Managed to take control of the situation where Blue Team have not. Yeah, you can see it very clearly when you look at the, the, the action that's going on each team, on each side of this mid barrier point. Everything is where the Blue Team is trying to push from. There is nothing. There's nothing sneaking around. There's nobody running around behind on the, blue, on the red side at all. It, it is the it is the red points to lose at this moment, and in fact, it's the red red's game to lose right now. Yeah, I mean they're on match point uh, right here. Blue with the uh, uber charge, but uh, a bit too hesitant on it, and you do need to use this uber charge. And oh, there, there you go, lazy purple gets the drop on him. That's what happens when you just hold on to it for too long. You end up losing it, and that is how it feels to play scout, ladies and gentlemen. I think there's a whole lot of how it feels going to be played out in, in this match right now. There's a few seconds left, I imagine, on the on the counter right now. Every player is going to be rushing head from into it, oh. trying to make a difference, but just too late. That As, is an absolute shame. Absolutely. Look, that was the third map loss, uh, and I don't think uh, anyone is going to say that they did poorly, uh, no, but they, they did, did win. Well. They did well, just not well enough to beat sleep, which is yep. unfortunate. And another quick thank you to It's Sova for the $25 as well. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, it's just very strong team play uh, from our red team, the uh, sleep squad. Um, just kind of uh, exerting that pressure, uh, exerting their dominance. And some big frags from Zulu Man, Proct, uh, Lazy Purple, Happy Purple. Everybody playing well. Yeah, yeah definitely. There were some definitely some good plays in there by by this uh, blue team. I, I, Taylor TF getting a beautiful air shot early on. Uh, uh, dude, the ninja even had uh, amazing effectiveness with his uh, his machete of doom. Um, oh yeah, th th there was. I mean, these of the of the teams we've seen so far, these two teams seem to be the most evenly matched right at the very beginning. There, right before there was a score on the scoreboard, um, that the counters were going down for both teams. I honestly believe that this was going to be the most like evenly uh based uh, competition of, of all that we're going to see this entire time um so it's a little bit surprising to see it seemingly go so most f uh, fundingly uh for the slick team sleep squad uh but unnamed definitely the unnamed as they are uh, known to their friends uh the unnamed uh deserve their their position in this competition uh they they, they deserve their place if not their position yeah, definitely. Uh, I, think, I think we will be going to a third match soon. There's a little bit of setup happening just now. Uh, I think it's going to be more of a fun orientated map as opposed to full on uh, live comp. Sort of, uh, night, life, live comp? Oh, we need to make that thing. Clive Omp. Uh, uh, Clive Omp, was, yes. My, my physics teacher was called uh, Clive Omp. Oh, d d d d incredible. And almost completely untrue. Impressive. 
Uh, we're going to pop over to have an interview in just a moment. I think that's someone joining in now. Uh, Mr. What's his face? Hello. He's still on mute. Somebody unmute him. Got, Unbag this man. We've, we've got Chedzi in as well. Chedzi, uh, how did that feel? Well, okay, so uh, um, <laughs> they take, I took that back and forth. Lazy Purple, how did you feel with the, that that map went for you? Have we got all our hosts, I mean, uh, guests, guests M- muted? I think you need to give them permissions. I, I think I think the fact that we're in Mumble <laughs> and, and not in Discord is confusing the life out of a lot of people here, so uh, I'm, I'm not sure whether or not we're um, going to be able to get that resolved. But uh, the first person to speak uh, gets the mic. Oh, this is a new competition. It winner takes all. Whoever speaks first. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh, oh, oh uh, there's a notification there for Lazy Purple. Purple. Oh! Try it again, dude. Try it again. We're hanging on your every breathe. And mouse press. <laughs> there we go. So- Yay! Uh, Lazy Purple wins! <laughs> Lazy Purple. So, Sleep Squad, not Woo! only did you guys win that entire match, but you certainly won the first to speak in Mumble competition. Uh, so <laughs> My uh, hero. Yeah. Uh, how did you how did you feel that that went for you? Uh that was surprisingly a very nice experience. Uh we <laughs> you know we put some real effort in into getting some team cohesion. We we pubbed a bit beforehand for some days and um like I know uh not many like this is supposed to be like a, not a super competitive event. So and a lot of these people uh on my team haven't you know, played in a official competitive format. So it was actually a nice rewarding experience to kind of like bring people up to speed on like, yeah, the heavy holds here and like this is their job and we expect our dispenser to be here and kind of like, I don't know, it was a really fun experience and I love competitive CF2 and it's really fun to share it with people. Yeah, you have uh, plenty of competitive experience, don't you? Uh, yeah, you could say that. I, I, I'm going to say that, thank you. I thank you for your uh, <laughs> uh, uh, But of course. <laughs> Uh, what do you think of your opponent, however? I know like JPEG has played a lot of competitive. Yes, I was very scared of JPEG, and simply seeing his <laughs> name on the enemy team, I was like... I was I th- terrified I thought, of JPEG. Yeah, <laughs> I thought he could single-handedly turn this into a wash against us, but um, that, that's one of the reasons I was also very pleased to see that our team cohesion actually was able to um, get us somewhere. Oh, that's awesome to hear. Uh, have any of our other colleagues that have joined chat able to speak yet? Yeah, I was thinking, uh, Mr. What's his, what's his face seems to be muting and unmuting himself on a regular basis. Uh, maybe we're going to get some words out of him. Uh, we've got a bit of Polybrow, but mm. Polybrow is, is is Polybrow playing in the last map? Are you, are you now in the unmuted state? Uh, or is the lag so bad that you ended up just here now? Yeah, that's... That's uh yeah. That, that's four hours later. We get a response from Polybrow, but uh, maybe maybe not so much right now. Boy, Mr. What's his face? Problem, are are you here with us? No, no, you're not. Okay, um, that's such a shame. Uh, Lazy Purple. Who did you? Who were you most fearful of? Oh, on, I mean, definitely, on that last... definitely, definitely JPEG. Um, <laughs> I I do notice that he um he played more team oriented role, which I very much respect. He was probably filling a similar role uh, as me in terms of trying to. Uh, get everyone up to speed on competitive play. So, uh, shout out to him for being a team player. Um, and he really, he really slayed at some points. So, yeah, that's awesome to hear. Uh, I forgot my question entirely. Hold on, I'm thinking of ice cream. Uh- <laughs> <laughs> so, Lazy Purple, what is your favorite combo of ice cream? Uh, while we've got you here. Oh yes. yes. Oh, okay, okay. My favorite combo, and it's like, I. I have to have both, right? I don't. I don't really want one or the other, but it's one scoop coffee, one scoop banana. Ooh, that sounds like a good combo. I don't like coffee, but coffee ice cream is actually surprisingly good for me. It is. It is. Like honestly, and again, I don't like bananas, but I like banana ice cream. I need to try that combo. <laughs> I am a bit of a connoisseur when it comes to ice cream, of course. Ah, uh, truly. I'm sure Agro will tell you because that's that's my diet. It's ice cream every day. It's really, it's really so, concerning. It's ice cream every day and occasional pizza. And I think that's as far as I'm aware. That is that is it. Actually, ordering me Chinese right now. Is, mm. <laughs> <laughs> I've got some rice on it. It's way delicious. Oh, how's nice. how's rice and ice cream? Uh, I'll tell you in a moment. I've so got some that, more ice cream in the freezer. That rice cream. <laughs> oh, ah! all right. Hold on. Uh, how do I how do I mute someone with more permissions than me? <laughs> <laughs> but like, yeah, no, generally, like uh, those of you here, thank you very much for joining in the games. Like, it was really fun to watch, and like both matches were pretty exciting. See how people played differently from what say we would play. 
like especially seeing other medics play other scouts and stuff play everyone plays in a different manner i've noticed that between different players and it can really yeah. affect like say like you i noticed you i noticed yourself uh lazy purple you got behind him a couple times which is, i have no idea how you got there <laughs> it's like, it's honestly. my purpose. It, I was born to flank, <laughs> but they did actually a pretty good job of um, not letting me do it. The engineer always had a mini up. Uh, I I needed a lot of help from my team to make sure that the mini was down, but it was rarely down. So good work to the enemy engineer. Uh, again, JPEG really had his work cut out for him playing combo and flank. Um, their soldier was in the right spot. Their demo was on flank a little too often, I think. Um, but you know he did stop me sometimes. So there's that. Yeah, yeah, every kill definitely counts, especially when it's a, a mid push, trying to get that control point under their sure, control. Sure, sure. I mean, do, do you think it's a little bit unfair that you practice during what is ostensibly a very charitable, like let's have fun match, or, or do you encourage other teams they know they're going to be taking part in these kind of things to go out and practice? Are you going to be going out and practicing after this? Is really what I'm trying well, to drive to. We didn't necessarily do the thing where we like, you know, get a scrim set up like a Highlander scrim. This was probably the first time a lot of people had actually played a Highlander match. I just wanted, you know, I wanted people to know what their role was and to kind of there's we really just got team cohesion going. And I, I think that's fine. I would encourage people. I always encourage people to bring the level of competition up because, I mean, the last thing I wanted, right, is to go into this like, ah, it doesn't matter, you know, whatever. And then we get stomped and everyone on my team is like, lazy, that was awful. <laughs> So I just wanted to make sure everyone had a good time on my side, and I think that the enemy team still had a good time. They played well. Some people might see the zero to three and be like, hoo, 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 right? That was clearly a, a close game with capping back and forth, and uh, everyone put forward their best foot. And I thought that was a good game. Yeah, it no, was. Definitely. It was certainly a good game from where I was sat. Mister Watson's face, uh, welcome. Uh, have you have you made it into the voice things? Are you with us? Speak now. Ethereal voices from beyond! Tap the desk from underneath three times. Blink twice if you're being held against your will. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he That's... didn't blink at all, folks. It's absolutely okay. He's not gagged. Uh, I, I can see Chedzy's in the chat here. Hello, Chedzy. Hello. Uh, hey. I believe you're the one helping set up the servers and stuff, aren't you? Uh, yeah, I'm in game. I'm trolling them uh, and <laughs> like launch, like doing anything uh people tell me to do basically excellent well uh obviously a lot less wouldn't be able to happen if you weren't there helping set up the servers which is absolutely appreciated for an event like this thank so, you very uh, much what do you think of the matches so far so you, you've obviously been lurking in the spectator haven't you uh, been watching make okay. sure things are running yeah honestly i will tell you the truth i was laughing my ass off whenever <laughs> like something happened that you guys didn't see and when you guys did see, there was a lot of funny stuff happening. So, yeah, I had fun. <laughs> Sorry, did you guys catch the 180 um, classic shot on stream? Uh, oh my god, yes. What? That was a 180? What? <laughs> so, what? Uh, I, I was very cocky and I got right behind uh, enemy sniper and put one meat shot in him, and I, but I didn't have anything else loaded in the scatter gun, so I whipped out the pistol. I got one pistol shot out and he... Like, before I could even see, 180 no-scope headshot me with the classic. <laughs> What an absolute legend. Yeah. That is incredible. Also, I want to give a quick thank you to another donation, but uh, for some reason I can't see the name. Uh, my page is bugged Zulu! out. Zulu! Is it Zulu? Is that the name? Thank you for the $50. And we passed 500. Oh. Hold on, let me see nice. if that's another nice. goal. Oh, congrats. <clears throat> is that one of our goals? Hold on, let me just quickly check. No. Uh... I think our goal was Ooh. just to be able to talk to Lazy Purple, to be honest. I mean, that's my, my life. is, is <laughs> no, my, my, my life's completely. I'm a big fan. <laughs> Aw, still... you guys. Come on. I'm flattered. But and also, also, everyone else in this chat is absolutely wonderful as well. Thank you, Chedzy. Thank you, Mr. Watts' face. And even though we've not heard from either Mr. Watts' face or Polly Brown, thank you both genuinely for popping by and trying. You're welcome. Oh! Whoa! There we Whoa! go. Who was this? There's a voice. That's Polly. Polly. Polly Brown. Uh -huh. Uh, was that, was that you just responding to what was said to you four hours ago, or uh, has Black got you again? It probably was. <laughs> oh yeah. no, we've lost him. <laughs> I'm back from Lake Sand, you see. It took me about four hours. Ah, you're Boy, here. How, how was the flight? Are you? Are, are you oh, the flight was oh, so much too. All right. Well, thank you very much, uh, folks, for popping in for the little interview. We short babby one. Thank you everyone for the donations so far. I think we are going to switch over to another video.
uh, showcasing a little bit more of special effect. Of course, the nations are very helpful for people in need that are disabled. Video games help connect families together, help connect friends, and special effects do wonderful things to make adapted controllers. And thank you, Mr. Watts' face. We could hear that there. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, we're going to switch over to a video for a little bit more info. Thank you very much, and we hope you stick around for the next match, which is going to be more fun-orientated, so stay tuned.